just because you're accusing us of tabloid journalism. You I'm don't not, I don't want to say I'm accusing you of tabloid, but all this stuff about these women, I mean, none of it's really relevant other than the legal ramifications of it, the FEC stuff and the lawsuits that have been filed. So you don't and think so, that it's relevant, just, just to, to drill down on that, you don't think that it's relevant, sort of the president's morality? You don't he, think He was that, not elected to be a moral leader. I mean, but, nobody in Washington is a moral leader. I mean, that's preposterous. But have you given up on the president of the United States? I didn't know elect him to be leader? my preacher or my pastor or even my husband. I elected him to be the the president of the United States to about national security, to make sure our nation is secure, to get our economy back on track. And I think that's why he was elected. And the approval numbers show that in spite of all of the negative press. And did you give Bill Clinton the same pass? Well, honestly, I wasn't really involved in politics at that but, time. But how did you feel but, personally? I mean, I was a single mom raising a young daughter at that time. So but I were was you offended by Bill Clinton. I mean, you know, when a man is unfaithful, that is between him and his wife and his God. That is not between you and I and all of the Amer all Americans out there. And you felt that, that way then, too. I, I do feel that way. And, but I do think I want to say there is a difference in the way the things were being reported under Bill Clinton and the way that they're being reported now. Okay. Um, I mean, there's ab there's absolutely a difference. OK, Anna, how do you see it?